Hi, uh, right now uh, we are going to talk about uh, diabetes diagnosis uh, system using uh, fuzzy inference. So we are going to use, uh, use a Python uh, 3.5. So basically we are going to uh, define, the, I mean you have to find out the set of rules uh, considering different parameters. So let me just go through the code. Okay, so we have like a training data set and uh, the test rules is there and we have the pre-process data and the data file. Okay, just have a quick glimpse of the data set. So this is the data set and uh, uh, let me walk through the variables what we used. We will be considering age, uh, BMI and I'll, I'll walk through it in the later part of the video. Uh, so let's, let's give an uh, execution. So I'm using Python uh, 3.5 ID. So okay, fine done. So these are the uh, dependencies you have to download. You have to, uh, you have to use uh, <coughs> Skip Fuzzy. Uh, so you have to you have to install. Uh, you can use pip install for this. Okay, so here it goes. Uh, what are the parameters? You know, uh, we are going to consider for the fuzzy uh, based radiation making. So it's basically like we start with age, uh, glucose level, and blood pressure, insulin, and BMI, and uh, you know uh, DPF function. So these are the functions. These are the variables we are going to uh, consider basically for that uh, uh, rules. So I am going to run it out, and this this may take like you know uh, uh, five to ten minutes. So it's a huge uh, work. <coughs> Uh, let me pause this video for a uh, few minutes so take some time uh, so here it goes uh, it has classified the set of rules and uh, so yeah the execution part is done okay now let's uh, just check the rules which have been generated uh, so it generated just now at 9:17. so let me open that stuff and okay here we go okay so these are the rules generated basically considering age glucose uh, blood pressure insulin uh, bmi dpf and diabetes and that's that uh, there's some sort of the status of the diabetes like zero to one so uh existing or not existing so this is how it works so basically we use like a uh, fuzzy inference method and uh, and that bit and we can also go for uh, prediction uh, yeah you can also uh, measure the accuracy of the uh, data sets uh, and the predicted uh, stuff so i'm going to run the graph for that here it goes so this is the original and the predicted so and the accuracy level is what 75 percentage fine that's it for this video thank you